you're Venetian, are you ready for the hot scorching heat of the summer and you need something just to take the edge off to cool you off? Then I think you're going to stay tuned and check out this video on these handheld fans I got right here. Something to try to keep you cool, all right? Just take the edge off, all right? So if you're interested in something like this, you might want to stay tuned and check out this video, all right? All right, yo, Skippy, roll that intro. Okay, YouTube, this is your boy, Mark for Loose Cruising Views, back to give another video. But you know how we do, before we get started, let's get all that business and politics out of the way. If you haven't already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and notification bell so you be notified of new videos. Tell a friend, tell a friend. Go ahead and subscribe, subscribe. All right, now that we got all that business and politics out of the way, let's get to the video. Whew, man. Man, it's getting hot. Whoa, man. What'd you say, Skippy? Oh, you're recording? Man, oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, sorry about that, sorry about that. Whoo, man, it's getting hot. Oh, hey, View Nation, it's your main man, Mark, back again with another video. Uh, today, we're gonna be taking a look at these uh, handheld fans. As you see, I've already opened one up because it's getting kind of hot in the studio with these lights and everything. And uh, yeah, you know, today, we're gonna be taking a look at these handheld fans and you know, just see what they're working with, all right? But before we get started, I want to give all thanks and praise to my Heavenly Father, God above, and Savior Jesus Christ. Because without God, nothing's possible. All right? Keep God in your life, and you'll be all right. All right? All right. All right. And also, uh, by the way, can you guys go down there and uh, do me a favor and hit that subscribe button? It's free. It don't cost anything. And you'll be helping somebody out. All right? You're helping somebody stay cool. All right? All right. Oh, View Nation, it's your main man, Ma. Back again with another video. Oh, today... You know, you know, we're getting ready for, we're getting ready for them uh, hot dog days of summer. You know, we, we, we're we in the springtime and we're already getting some hot days so far. And uh, and I've been seeing these all over the interwebs. I'm like, man, look, I wonder if these things are any good, if they even work. So uh, as you see, I already opened one up because it gets real hot in the studio. This one, let me see, let me see. This The name of this one is uh, Icy Fan, all right? I was just going to do a, a, one, a video on each one of them. I said, we don't make sense. Let me just do a, a video and showcasing all of them at one time, you know, just cover everything, you know, at once. All right. So let me go here and see if I can find this one. Uh, let's see here. All right, here we go. This one uh, is from a company called uh, Fash Face. It's spelled F A S H. F A C E, all right, Fash Face, all right. This is their uh, uh, handheld fan, as you can see right here. It, had, it came with lanyards and all that good stuff. You know, you strap it, you know, put, wear it around your neck so it'd be a neck fan or whatever. And it, when it moves, it's adjustable or whatever. So you want to sit it down somewhere and uh, just chill, you know. But then also it has like a little little gimmick right here, a little uh, a little uh, supposed to be light, a flashlight. You know, we got the little Make it looks like a, I don't know, like a tooth or a cat, you know, but you know, it is what it is. We got the little branding right here, all right? You know, you see it because this is so white, all right? And right here, it also has uh, the fan fan switch and they have something different that some of these fans don't have. And that's like a uh, like a cooling plate on here to try to help keep you cool where you can just rub it against your skin. And uh, if this thing is, gets real, real cold. So let me read some specs of the spec junkies out there. This one is the uh, portable handheld uh, mini fan air conditioner, uh, ice cooling mode with three speeds, wind, uh, three speed wind, and it has a 4,000 mAh rechargeable battery, USB C, uh, personal fan, battery operated small pocket fan with LED light for home and outdoor, all right? Let's see here, let's see, it doesn't say how long the battery uh, holds on here. Let's see here, this one says, um, uh, let's see here. Equipped with silver metal around the ring. Okay, all right. All right, let's see here, the refrigerant piece. This is the refrigerant piece right here. It has uh, instant three second cooling. So th uh, this thing, I noticed it gets cold real quick. Uh, it has just with three speeds. Uh, and it's saying, uh, let me read it right here, it says, Portal offers three gear settings and cool switch. Powered by high speed motor, it generates strong airflow to keep you cool with a 4,000 mAh rechargeable battery provides a runtime of three to 16 hours without using the ice cooling function. Now, even with the ice cold feature enabled, 
you can still enjoy up to 120 minutes. All right, so that's a big difference. That's a big difference. And, and uh, like I said, it's, it's going to vary, you know, uh, you know, de you know, depending on usage. Because if you have it maxed out and you got the cooling thing on there, you might not get, you know, what they're saying, you know, on the website. All right, and it has a multifunction. Uh, well, it has an LED, a LED uh, light on it. So really don't understand what it's about. It's just I me mean, because it would have been better just to have this plastic, this rubber piece off of here and just so you can set it up like that. But other than that, you know, it's, uh, it's, it's decent, it's decent. Let me go ahead and uh, turn the fan on. So you can, this is on low mode. Second gear, third gear. All right, so let me see, one, two, three, and refrigerant, all right? So let's see here. Let me go ahead and uh, turn it around so you can see it. But first, let me go get a, uh, let me get something so I can see, I can check the temperature on here and see how cold this thing gets, all right? Hold tight. All right, I'm back, V Nation. I, I need to start keeping my stuff right here so I can organize, so I can have everything, so I don't have to be searching for stuff. But anyway, I got like a little handheld thermometer, uh, you know, you can see, uh, so we can check the temperature of it. All right, so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna shoot it real quick. And it's showing 89. So I'm gonna, I'm, gonna hit the, I'm gonna hit it one more time. It's saying 80, 89.7. I don't know if you're able to see that. So what I'm gonna do is turn it on. All right. And you have to turn the fan on in order to use the, uh, cause that's like the main power mode in order to use the little refrigerator, uh, refrigerant cooling plate mode. All right. So they're saying it gets cold real quick. And yeah, it's getting cold. So let me, let me hit it one more time. All right. It's, that's saying uh, 88. All right, I hit it uh, one more time. 88.4, hit, hit it again. 87, as you can see it's going down. You get it where you can see it. 81. So yeah, it does, you see, it does cool off it, 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 down to 81. But um, let's see, I wanna see how strong it is. So the lowest setting, you know, really, it's really not putting anything out. But when you get to the second setting, you feel it a little bit. Uh, and then a higher setting, it's, it's, it's all right. I mean, it, it might take the edge off, but I've had it outside before using it in the, in the car and, if you're expecting any of these these fans, to, these handheld fans to just cool you off completely, you, you're in for a, a rude awakening because they don't. They just pretty much, you know, take the edge off. You know, they really don't really cool your whole body down. They're meant for being like indoor or somewhere where you can control the temperature or something like that. Or if you're sitting in the shade somewhere and you got a little breeze, that's where these, these things will shine right here, all right? Let me see, well, I'm trying to remember how to turn the, the light on on here. Let's see here. Let me see if I press and hold. Oh, okay. Press and hold. And that's when that little light comes on. And press and hold. Goes off. I mean, they could they could have did without this. Cut this off and then put a little flashlight at the bottom. It would have been better. Let me get my wind meter out real quick. And uh, so we can see how much uh, wind is putting out. All right. All right. Let's see here. All right. We get on the lowest setting, all right, so you can see it. All right. Uh, okay. If I can get the button. All right, try to do this backwards. All right, that's, it's looking like a three. All right, that's, that's one. Speed two, we're looking at about 4.2. 4.5, you know, give or take. And this is the highest setting, 5.6, 5.6, all right? So this will give you a, a weed, uh, uh, not a weed, but a uh, speed of 5.6. So I'm, I'm gonna put that aside. As you can see, I, you know, I did a review on this one. This one, you know, 
some consider it a, a handheld fan, but others, you know, just consider it basically a, a, a blower, like, you know, a duster. So, but I've used it as a fan because, man, this thing is a beast. And I did a video on this one, so I'm, I'm going to hold off on that one for last, all right, so we can get the, uh, these bad boys out. All right, let's see what we're going to do next. Let's go ahead and do, uh, I'm going to put the uh, Just Lifes to the side so they can be together. So I'm going to try this next one. This one is from, uh, let's see, uh, doesn't say anything. It just says cooling handheld fan. It doesn't have a name or anything. Well, let me let me see if I can get out here and uh, see which one is. Okay, this one is. Okay, this one is the uh, from a. It's called the Reekin Star. I'm not sure, you know, if that's the name of it, but it just says purple and gray uh, fan. So I'm gonna read off some of the specs uh, for the spec junkies. Portable handheld turbo fan, 100 speeds, adjustable. USB, USB rechargeable fan, battery operated, uh, digital display, 3600 mile rechargeable battery, uh, mini jet fan, cooling fan for travel and camping and all that good stuff. Uh, it says ice cold cooler. So this, this has a cooling plate like this one has. It has a cooling plate like that one. Uh, let's see right here. It also has a LED display, which I really like. This one doesn't have an LED display. Uh, let's see here, um, portable, stylish, yeah, we'll, yeah, we'll see about that now. Rechargeable convenience, doesn't say how many hours. So the built-in fan is 1.4 inches. I'm trying to find the battery uh, life on here. All right, it's saying one short press uh, to turn it on and a uh, long press uh, according to the volume, to the air volume to operate it and let's see double click to check the battery and uh, press to turn it off or cooling button to turn it to turn it on so yeah I don't I'm, you know just all over the place with this uh, let's see it still doesn't show anything about battery life so yeah don't show anything about battery life so let's go ahead and just open it up because it's getting hot in here all right take this out all right see what else is in the box all right and you can see I've been, I used this one before. You know, I tried to test it out before I got it out. So I'm gonna toss that box aside. I got some instructions right here. I don't need those. But this one does, uh, does work pretty good. As you can see right here, you know, we got the, you know, purple and gray uh, colorway. Uh, here's your uh, LED screen right here. And you got your refrigerant button right here. And you got your, uh, your uh, power button right here. The doubles as a, uh, I'm going to say to turn on the fan speed, all right? Then on the back, you got your USB-C charging port right here. Did I show you the charging port on this one? Yeah, the charging port on this one is on the side. I'm just trying to move, so trying to get through these fans. Uh, let's see here. Uh, let's see here. The power button. And, and see, and this is what I'm talking about. This one should have uh, went flat. Uh, this one should have been flat like that. And it would have been better if you know if this one was flat like that, but you know it is what it is. And sorry for the train; the train likes to come by when I'm uh, doing videos. But anyway, uh, let's go ahead and turn it on and see what we're working with. All right, one click on, and you see it's showing uh speed, it's showing speed one. All right, one click off. So basically, one click to turn it on, and you got to press and hold to go through the speeds. You see that as you can see the screen right here. All right, it, uh, it is moving up. You got to press and hold. That's at the top speed, 100. And if you want to turn it down, you got to press the uh, refrigerant uh, button right here. And it's not on, but I'm, and that makes it go down. So the refrigerant button does double duty. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna turn on the refrigerant. Well, I'm gonna turn it off real quick. The, the refrigerant button does double duty. It turns the refrigerant uh, uh, cooling plate, I'm just gonna call it cooling plate on and off. And also it, it uh, you know, that's the way to decrease the speed, you know. I, I, I kind of think that I wish it would have had a separate switch, but you know, it is what it is, all right. So uh, let's see here. Let me check the temperature on here real quick on the a cooling plate. So I'm gonna hit it real quick. 88.7, all right. As you can see here, it's saying 88.7. All right, so 
at 87, so I'm, I'm, I'm gonna turn it on. And that, and that might be just because the fan is on. All right, so I got the refrigerant plate on here now, it's on, let me feel it. Oh yeah, that thing is getting ice cold, it's getting ice cold. So, I'm gonna hit it again. 80, wow, that's a big difference. That is a big difference. It went from 87 to 88 to down to 80. Let's hit it again. 79.9, so as you see, these cooling plates work, and they feel good against your skin too. I mean, when you, when you a hot day out there and rubbing this against your forehead. Oh, now it's saying low, so basically, yeah. And this is meant for, you know, checking your temperatures, you know, and everything. But anyway, yeah. So the cooling plates do work and they get cold. And, it's, you know, after a while of uh, uh, having it running and having to cool it, you, uh, sometimes you can see a little condensation on here, you know, from it being ice cold. You might be able to see that now. Yep, you can see that now. See a little condensation on here? You, you know, then you may not be able to see it because of the video. But anyway, let's go ahead and check the speed on here. All right, let's go ahead and turn the meter back on. I'm going to get it back down. I'm going to turn the, uh, okay, I'm going to turn that uh, refrigerant off. All right, so one more, I'm going to bring it down to about, uh, I'm going to bring it down to uh, speed 16. So, all right, let me turn this around where you can see it. All right, this is a, uh, Level 16, that's 36, and we are already uh, more powerful than the uh, white fan we looked at a minute ago. All right, so let's crank it back up, let's crank it up to, okay, I turned it off. Let's crank it up to about halfway to 50. All right, now this is at 50. All right, 9.2 at 50. All right, let's crank it to about 75%. That's 76 right now, it's at 76, but. Oh man, it's getting up there, 10.5. All right, let's hit it to max. Ooh, man, that's putting out some air. Ooh, that feel good. As you can see there, it's 11.6 or 8. So it's putting out a little, some, it's putting out some air. It's putting out some air. All right. So it's about 11.6 miles per hour. Wait a minute. It's trying to get to 12. So we just go ahead at 11.8. Uh, and that's at 100%. And as I don't know if you notice, uh, when I click the, uh, when I click the, uh, Trying to get it, when y'all click the refrigerant light on here, as you see that little that little green icon, every time I push the button, it comes on. That lets you know. Let me turn this down. That lets you know that the uh, that lets you know that the refrigerant uh, feature is on. So, all right, so we put that one to the side. So far, that's the uh, you know they got the strongest airflow. All right, so let's move over to the other you know. I'll say generic one. Let's see, let's go back. Let's see which one this one is. Okay, okay, this is another one from Fast uh, Fash Face. All right, so I got two of them from Fast Face, all right? All right, so let's go ahead and see the box and everything. You know, nothing really special, just, uh, let me see, uh, digital display, just like the other one, multiple security, not sure what that means, powerful, uh, concentrated turbo, so that's the, the thing these two got in common, they, they got the turbo, they, turbo, you know, they're claiming they got turbo. High wind speed, concentrated. Let me uh, give you some more specs for the spec junkies on this one. Handheld fan, mini personal fan, uh, 4,000 mAh, charitable battery, portable fan, speeds from one to 100, just like the other one. Uh, adjustable turbo, small fan, digital display, USB fan for traveling, all that makeup and or whatever. All right, and the color white. Uh, let's see here. Uh, just with wind speeds. And when it comes to the battery life, it's saying powerful brushless motor. So it has a brushless motor featuring a three phase brushless motor and 4,000 mile battery rechargeable. 
This handheld fan delivers a superb wind speed, power, and endurance with max wind speed of about 9 miles an hour. Or it just says 9M, so I'm not sure if they, what, they, what they're meaning. But um, and a rotation speed three times that of a regular personal fan, uh, reaching up to uh, 15,000 RPMs. All right. Uh, this portable fan keeps you cool for about 2.5 hours to 15 hours. And that's the guess, and they even say that on here. It says depending on speed. So that's depending on usage is how long, you know, to determine how long the battery is going to last. Uh, versatile charging, there's USB, uh, rechargeable 5 volt 2 amp. Uh, let's see here. And whether you prefer to use the power bank uh, to charge it or laptop, you could do either one. Uh, portable, multiple ways to use. All right, all right. So that's that's it. You know. So that's that's the most important part. We got that out for the spec junkies. Let's take it out. All right. Got nothing else in the box. Toss the box. Come with a USB-C cable. You know to charge it up. All right. Take it out. Toss that to the side. Not sure what this is all about. So I'm gonna put that aside. Maybe that was to protect it from shipping. And here it is. All right. Got like a cream color white. And let's see how. Okay, they're about the same size. They're about the same size. Uh, uh, this one has the screen on the on the part that's facing you, so I would say that's the front, and, and it's in the middle. Versus this one has it on, on the you know, a little small screen right here. So let's go ahead and turn this one on. You can see that they got the buttons right here. Turn it on. Now this one has a little something different that this one doesn't have. This one has a, a, a on and off kill switch on the back. So like you know it's you know. Uh, See if I turn it on. All right, let me see. If I turn it on, and it shows. I turn it on. It shows the percentage of battery percentage on there, right? So I turn it off, and if I try to turn this on, they won't come on. So if I do like this, as you see the display came on, but uh, it's it's the fan is not moving. All right, and this one doesn't have the cooling plate. All right, so that's the difference between these two. Don't have a cooling between this one and these two, this one doesn't have a cooling plate. So, like I said, this kill switch, USB-C charging slot right there, and a little LED let you know it's charging in a blink, whatever. So, and the power switch goes up and down. See, that's this is what I'm talking about. I wish it would have had an up and down switch on this one instead of you know, having one switch do double duty, all right? So let me go ahead and cut it back. Let me go ahead and cut it back on, all right? Let's go ahead and, all right, we are at, at 20, all right? Let me go back down to about, uh, matter of fact, I'm gonna go 25. Crank it up to 25. All right, so where's our wind meter at? All right, let's get it out. It is kind of loud. All right, we, that's 25. So let's crank it, let's crank it up some more. Let's crank it up to, let's go forward. Well, let's go to 50, halfway. All right, so this is 50, this is halfway. Nine, it's going between 9.8 and 10. All right, 10.1, all right. So let's crank it to 75%. Oh man, I'm telling you, this wind feels good. All right, that's 75 percent. 75 percent. We're sitting at 11.8. Uh, 11 point. A steady 11.8. All right. Let's go. Let's crank it up to the max. Sounds like a jet, don't it? 13 miles an hour. So this one might be. I can remember this one might be the fastest one. Most uh, airflow, 13, holding steady, all right. Man, feels good. So, so far I'm thinking it's between these two should be the most uh, airflow, most powerful ones out of it. All right, let me cut this off. And this is where a lanyard would go. Uh, not sure where a lanyard is, but you know, I got so many lanyards laying around here, that's, you know, I ain't worried about that. So I'm gonna put that one down, I'll turn it around this way, turn it that way up, all right. So now let's get into the Just Life, all right? The Just Life one is the one that kind of started it all, in my opinion, when it comes to the, uh, uh, when it comes to the uh, 
turbo handheld phones because that's the handheld fans because this was the first one I've seen on the interweb. So let's go ahead and check this one out. Let me go to their web page. Uh, let's see here where we go. Uh, we're going to do, uh, let's go do the, the little dog first. We're going to do the little dog first, you know, get get them uh, the attention first. So we're going to get the little one first. And let's see, this one is the Just Life Portable Handheld Turbo Fan. Doesn't say model, it's the, uh, this one is the gray, and it's 3600, uh, 3600 mile uh, rechargeable battery. It says uh, portable handheld turbo fan, mini rechargeable, uh, 12 hour max cooling time, and that's gonna vary. Uh, 3600 mile battery, small battery, personal fan, pocket fan, so you can fit in your pocket with five speeds for women, men, traveling, camping, outdoors, all right? All right, so that's all I've really got to say on this one. Just about, you know, they got everything right there in a nutshell in that, uh, in that brief uh, description. So let's go ahead and uh, let's see the box. There's the box right here. All right. And let's see here what's included in the box. I got you, let's tell you what's included in the box. And got some more information you can pause this reading for yourself. Let's get this bad boy out of the box. All right. Comes with a lan lanyard. I mean, something to put around your neck so you can carry it around your neck. <sighs> let's get it out. All right. All right, nothing else in the box. Toss the box, get out the paper. And I got an instruction booklet, toss that with the other ones. Got a USB-C to US, or USB-C charging cord. So all of them is coming with a USB charging cord. This is like a little smaller one. I'm gonna put that to the side and put these lanyards to the side. Probably gonna have them all mixed up by the end of the day. All right, and this is the, the uh, Jewish Life, Just Life. Uh, I'm messing up because it's spelled J-I-S-U life all right and that's how it's spelled so this one has a uh, power it has a kill switch too on the side this has a quick kill switch right here on the side um or power switch whatever you want to call it and this is usb-c charging slot right here uh and the power button on the front all right and that's like your trigger so uh all right right now i got it off so i'm gonna turn it on and this one doesn't have no refrigerant plate or cooling plate all right so it's just five different speed and it's tiny this thing is so tiny that it'll just fit in your pocket. Matter of fact, uh, where do I got a phone somewhere? Yeah, this is a Note 20 Ultra. This is the size of a Note 20 Ultra. It fit, it fit in your pocket. It, it fit in your pocket. All right, so let's cut it on. All right, uh, let's see here. And you know, when I cut it on, the little LED blinked. The little LED blink again. All right, that's five speed, so let's go ahead and uh, test it out. Speed one. This is speed one, two, three, four, or is that five? Okay, that's five. 10 miles an hour. All right, and I noticed the stream on the, the, the air coming out of here is like a little little thin air stream of airflow coming out of this one. So this one fit in your pocket, just something to really like if you're sweating some, you know, sweating to cool you off. And it's loud too, on the highest setting. It sounds like a jet engine. All right, let's get to the last one. All right, and I might have some another one, a, a little a little extra to put in there with these. It's not these type, but anyway. All right, this one uh, is the Just Life again. Let me go to there. Uh, let's see where we are. Uh, let's see here. And this one just came in today. All right. All right, this is the Just Life. Um, it's, a, it's called the Life 4. That's the model name for this one, the Life 4. And this, uh, if I'm not mistaken, this might be the cheapest one out of the bunch. Uh, upgraded powerful, uh, portable fan with powerful wind, USB uh, rechargeable. Mini handheld fan with digital display, 3600 mile rechargeable battery, five wind speeds, ideal for travel and all that good stuff. Uh, let's see, it doesn't say anything about the uh, uh, battery life. Okay, it says a 3600 mile battery with five adjustable wind speeds, uh, 13 hours of usage. That's gonna vary. Uh, let's see here. An experience 13 hours of continuous cooling. Okay, you know, that's like, like I said, it's gonna depend. So let's go ahead and get this bad boy out of the box for this camera act up again all right all right so what we got in the box we've got 
another lanyard, throw them lanyards inside, another USB-C, you know, just, boy, I got so many cords and lanyards, it's crazy. Uh, I don't know what this is, this is something in the box. Um, all right, uh, looks like nothing else in the box. And it's, you know, instruction booklet, toss that to the side. And here is the fan itself. Got the little Just Life branding on there, just like the uh, the little baby one. All right, all right, got the Just Life on there. Got your power button up front. Uh, you got a kill switch on the back and a USB-C charging slot. And this one sits flat, you know. This one doesn't have a rubber stopper, like rubber. This one has like a little rubber stopper on the bottom, but this one doesn't. All right, so, oh, I actually let me turn it on. Uh, let me hit the kill switch, all right? All right, let's, let's peel this paper off on the screen. All right, so this one has the screen on the front like this one, all right? Uh, let's see, this one, and this one just has a little tiny screen. So I like these big screens on there, you know, anyway. All right, so what I'm gonna do is hit the switch. It says it has five modes. So let me let me hit the kill switch on there because I that turns it off. So let's go ahead and get the uh, wind meter out here again, and let's go ahead and see. Let me go ahead and turn it on. As you can see, it's, okay when you, it shows you how much battery life is in there. So it came with a. Uh, all right, let me go back. Sixty-two uh, percent. All right, so all right. Speed one. Oh, I thought it would help if I turn the, the, the wind meter back on. So this is speed one. Speed two. Speed three. Speed four. Speed five. Okay, we, we're uh, clocking 10.7 miles per hour. So it's not as strong as some of the other ones like this one, uh, but you know, it gets the job done, all right? Whew. And it's, it's showing you on here, it shows you which level you're on too, right here. That's cool too. It would have been nicer if this one would have been a, a zero to 100, but it is what it is. And all of them are going at max speed are going to be loud, so you know, you know, just FYI, when you get these bad boys, you know, you know, you, you can't be in a quiet setting because they do get loud. They sound like little turbo engines. I'll turn them all on Let's look real quick. Five. Okay, I have to hit the kill, kill switch. Sounds like another jet engine. But matter of fact, let me just turn this off, and I'm going to show you something just, just real quick. Hopefully, the uh, camera doesn't act up. All right, turn them off. Hit the kill switch. This is the easy way to turn it off. Now, this one, like I said, is a duster. All right, mark it as a duster, and this comes off. So I'm going to take this off and hit the power button on this one. I got a video. I'll leave a link to the video on this one on, in the description box. But here's the trigger. This got three speeds on it, so you got. Um, all right, so this is the lowest speed on this one. This is a low speed at nine. All right, speed two. Look at that, that's crazy. And speed, the, the highest speed. Yeah, yeah, this one right here, woo! This one will blow you away. If I wanted something to cool me off, even though it's marketed as a duster, I probably would take this one with me, because uh, this one, this one blow you away. And then here's a little honorable mention. This is one of the fans I had last year. Uh, that kind of started my little, you know, obsession with these uh, handheld fans. This is a little small one. I think this is from, uh, oh, this is from Just Life too. Okay, so I had some of their products before. This one has a flashlight. Um, I don't even know where, uh, I don't even think this one, they got this one anymore, but um, got a little picture of a little, I guess it's supposed to be a little bear on here. And uh, I was had it charging, so you have LED light showing it was charging. 
uh, and then this uh, power button uh, does double duty to turn it on. So if I want to hold, press and hold, that turns on the flashlight and press and hold to turn it off. No other functions with the light, just one, you know, light uh, mode, all right? So getting this out, you got to pull it out like so. You see that right there? And you can hold it like this or it fold down like that if you want to sit it somewhere, but it, it's not going to stand up. And as the, the fan, you see the blades cl uh, claps down. Uh, and th uh, this one does not compare to the other ones. Two, one, two. So this only got two speeds. So just, just to be, just to check, let's see what uh, we're working with right here. This is the lowest speed. All right. I'm gonna do it sideways so we get it in there. No, that one, that was a high speed. This is low speed. High speed. It doesn't compare, it doesn't go nowhere, compare nowhere near these other ones. So, you know, and then it, I like how it collapses down. This one definitely fits easy in your pocket. And also, if I'm not mistaken, it does double duty as a power bank. So I think it has like a 5,000 mile rechargeable battery in here. So, yeah, you know. So this this is pretty cool. It's pretty cool. And here comes the train again. I mean, boy, these trains are busy today. Like I say, View Nation, these, these trains, I think they just wait till they get by the office and blow the horn because they want to they want to be on they want to be featured on loose screws and views. All right, all right. So as you can see here, all our fans up here. We got one, two. Let's see, three, four. So let's say one. Well. I'm just gonna put that aside as a duster. One, two, three, four, five. This is not a fan, all right? So, do I think they're any good? Yes, and then, you know, with, with you know, with some kind of, you know, with a, with a little quirk or, you know, if you're looking for this to, these fans to just cool you off completely, that's gonna be a no-go. Uh, will they take the edge off? Yes. But don't be expecting a miracle. Like if you're sitting outside in like hot blazing uh, summertime weather, they, they're, they're not really going to do anything. These, like I said, are meant to be indoors in a controlled environment or like if you're sitting in the shade somewhere with a good breeze, then they'll help. If you're outside in hot weather and sweating, you know, when you when the uh, fan, the cold air hits that sweat, yes, it's going to feel cold. It's going to feel cold on you. But after a quick five, ten seconds, that feeling is gonna go away and you're gonna be back hot again. So if you're looking to buy these handheld fans, thinking that they're gonna cool you off completely, they're not. I'm just I'm just letting you know now before you go and spend your, all your money on something and then you'll be disappointed and be sending it back. No, they take the edge off and you know, if you're sitting in the car, say you're sitting in the car, you know, waiting on somebody or something, and this will, this will help, this will help. You know, if it's blazing hot, it's not gonna do anything. If you're sweating, it's gonna kind of drive the sweat, but other than that, that's it. So don't expect miracles out of these fans. You know, they're, they're handheld turbo fans that, you know, just can't pretty much take the edge off. And it, it's good to have. It's better to have something like this than nothing, all right? All right. And I'm sorry about this video lasting so long. I, I just, you know, instead of doing one separate video for each one of these fans, I just want to do all of them in one setting, get it over with, all right? Because this is a lot of stuff. And I got tons of other videos I got to get to. Like I got it with this video, got to uh, do this on this power bank. Like, as soon as I get done with this one, still so cleaning all this stuff up. So, yeah, and then I got a video coming on this right here, this uh, lantern slash Bluetooth speaker. So, yeah, I got so much stuff coming. So, I said, let me just combine all this in one in one setting, all right? So, I appreciate everybody taking out time to check out this video. Sorry it was so long, but, you know, I wanted to make sure you guys see a different variety of other fans so you can make have a better uh, understanding of, of, you know, what you want to get when you're uh, looking for a fan, all right? All right. If you haven't already, go ahead and hit that like, subscribe, and notification bell to be notified of new videos. Tell a friend, tell a friend, tell that friend, tell the friend to subscribe, 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 so they can see cool, neat products and gadgets like this on the channel, all right? All right. And I appreciate everybody taking out time to check out the video. And like I always say, treat people how you want to be treated. Treat people better than you want to be treated, all right? All right. And see, the message for today is, hmm, oh yeah, I got one. Uh, pay attention to your body. You're probably saying, Mark, what do you mean by that? You know, a lot of times we get so hyped up and busy during our day and, and we don't pay attention to our body and, you know, 
And it's when your body is pretty much, you know, tries to tell you what's if something wrong with you. If you're overheating, like, you know, you know I'm ex-military and you be out there in the field in the hot weather. And uh, sometimes people get heat strokes because they're not hydrating. They're not paying attention to their body when they, you're starting to get feel weak and, and stuff. You know, pay attention to the body because when, when you first when you first getting ready to get into that phase, you, you start getting a dry mouth. That's the first sign your body trying to tell you you need to hydrate and, so, and, get, and take a break and be cool. But so, but anything though, pay attention to your body because your body is going to warn you and tell you if something is wrong. So stay healthy and pay attention to your body. And that's the message for the day. This is your main man, Martha Lewis, Green Views. Stay cool, baby. And I'm out. Peace.